The 2023 Nobel Prize in Physics this year is being shared equally among three scientists for research into electrons in flashes of light. The 2023 Nobel Prize in Physics in equal shares to Pierre Agostini, the Ohio State University, USA, Ferenc Krauss, Max Planck Institute for Quantum Optik, Garsching, and Ludwig, Ludwig Maximilians Universität München, Germany, and Anne Lier, Lund University, Sweden, for experimental methods that generate attosecond pulses of light for the study of electron dynamics in matter. The announcement from the General Secretary of the Royal Swedish Academy of Scientists, the three researchers, Pierre Agostini, Ferenc Krauss, and Anne Louillier, jointly awarded the Nobel Prize in Physics. And again, it was for their work on experimental methods generating attosecond pulses of light for the study of electron dynamics in matter. So that's a way of looking at electrons in split seconds quintillionths of seconds, in fact, quintillionths. Abby Kugathasen studying up as if she was writing a final for us this morning to tell us more about the work of these new Lobel laureates. Good morning, Abby. Good morning, Heather. It certainly felt like it this morning. Now, just over 100 years after the Nobel Prize in Physics was awarded to Albert Einstein, the Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences has named three more scientists, as you just mentioned, to join that illustrious group. That's Pierre Augustini with the University of Ohio, Ferenc Krauss, who's at the University of Munich in Germany, and Anne Lillier at Lund University in Sweden. And the Nobel Committee says these three winners helped create flashes of light, exceptionally short flashes in order to observe the rapid movement of electrons. And that movement is so fast that it's measured in attoseconds. To get an idea of how quick that is, one attosecond is to one second as one second is to the age of our universe. Now, this research could be used in molecular fingerprinting, which could help detect cancers at an extremely early stage, so significant, certainly. Now, we did hear from Dr. Lillier after the announcement. She talked about how she received the phone call from the committee while she was in the middle of a lecture, and it was quite difficult to get through the last 30 minutes of her class after that pleasant surprise. Let's have a listen. This is the, the most prestigious prize, and uh, I am so happy to, uh, to get this prize. It's, it's incredible. And uh, as you know, there are not so many women that uh, get this prize, so uh, it's, uh, it's very, very special. In fact, she's only the fifth woman to win a Nobel Prize in physics. The three winners will share this award, which is worth about 1.36 million Canadian dollars, and they'll be honored in December at a ceremony in Stockholm. And there are more prizes to come. Tomorrow, the Nobel for Chemistry will be made public, and the Nobel Peace Prize, Heather, will be announced on Friday. And we will have coverage of all of them for this Nobel Week. Thank you, Abby Kugadasen.